What's up guys, John here. Uh, so we are driving through the pouring rain, good thing it's not snow, to uh, St. Catharines, Ontario, where I've got a machine shop making me a whole mess of uh, titanium Emerson handles for the CQC7. Uh, so we're going in right now to check in on things, and they said they're cutting the first batch, so we're gonna check it out. And um, we'll shoot all kinds of cool video and see what they're up to. Speeding it up slow to see how fast we can push it. Yeah. I don't want to ruin the sheet, right? Yeah. That sounds good. It's not making any noise at all. Uh, it's a pretty heavy machine. So yeah, it is. I mean, what we'll have to do is then on the next set, we're going to push it even harder. Uh, basically, until we burn out a cut. Then back up. Right? And what. Um, what are you looking to happen, like to chip an end mill or to yeah, burn up the material? Well, don't want to work, right. work hard in the material because if you work hard in the material, then I'll blow the cut them up. So right, I think yeah. that's the point you want to get to. You want to get that fine yeah. line where uh, you know, we're pushing as fast as we go and we get the cutter like we expect. Yeah. Hmm. So all the programs are done. Uh, this one will come off with all the holes in it and all the pockets in it. Well, okay. We basically just cut them out, put them in our soft dust, which I'm yeah. going to make tomorrow. Okay. I've got the material here, and then we start running the second stuff. We'll do that on another machine. Ooh. Those little chunks that are oh, left yeah. over. Yeah, yeah. Okay. That's awesome. Perfect. It probably doesn't get much better than that with a finish pass, eh? Probably not. I don't know. Yeah. I don't know. And the part, the that's part. the key is too, is that when we speed it up on the second second round, yeah. it's where the work house that surface thing is going to be up there. Yeah, so yeah. it's a whole bunch of stuff that we've got to do. Right? I'm still going with the same chip per seat. Right. So it doesn't matter how fast I go. You're running this, set, you're running this set faster than we ran the last yeah. set, right? So we're already ramping it up. Yeah. Okay. What is your chip per tooth? Uh, it's actually half a thou. Half a thou, okay. That's Five recommended thousand, yeah. from what I've read online. Okay. So, it's a good reference number. I can't believe how good that sounds. It's not making any noise at all. With the titanium, too, we got the Yeah, actually, slowly. So, what do we got? 1200 RPM. What's the feed rate? 2.4. 2.4, okay. What machine is this? Fidel, 4020. So the parts are running away, they sound great, they, they work great. Um, Niagara Precision's doing a wonderful job and uh, couldn't be happier. All right, so this is the middle chunk, just came out. Um, instead of doing a roughing pass and then a finish pass, they decided to just do one single pass. And the surface finish is great, so it worked out perfect. going at 1200 RPM, 2.2 or so inches per minute. It sounds just beautiful.
So these are my aluminum versions. This is the uh, display side, I believe, of the handle. 14 of them. Got the profile all done. Next, they're going to do the pockets and then drill the holes. And then later, they're going to, another day, they're going to make soft jaws that are going to clamp it down like that. And then do the corner rounder and then face it off and put my logo on it. So that's another day. This look awesome. Well, thank you very much. You're welcome, John. Really appreciate it. Yep. And uh, we'll keep in touch and I can't wait to have this finished. Yeah. Hopefully this will be project. a long and lasting relationship. <laughs> we hope so. So that wraps up our trick trip to Niagara Precision. Uh, he lent me a magnetic base, so I'm going to make a little bracket so I can mount a uh, GoPro onto this and then we'll put it in with the machine. And uh, next time we do a run of parts, we'll uh, have a GoPro throughout the entire process. It'll get all wet and chips everywhere and coolant and it'll be awesome. So uh, thanks for watching guys and stay tuned, we'll do more videos from here and at home obviously and uh, take care, bye.